Hey guys, that my gaming back here for the video, guys. Today we're talking about what to expect from the playoff promo, and this is literally gonna be the craziest month because we get the playoff, we get team of the year, and then we get the Super Bowl. So let's go ahead and break this down. So starting off right away, there are three different releases of the playoff promo: wild card, divisional, championship. Just like real life, obviously, all leads to the Super Bowl promo. Now every single year, whatever that is the case, we also have a really high overall usually 97 overall champion uh one year was to one year it was um deon sanders and that last year it was actually c smith senor so these of course are going to go ahead and be you put in all three 96 overall champions from the playoffs in order to get the 97 overall ultimate champion so last year ended up being Joe Montana, Adrian Wilson, and John Abraham. So if we go back here, you guys can see as you go through, each release has their own 96 overall champion. So of course, that was Joe, uh, that was John Abraham, Joe Montana, and then we also do have Adrian Wilson. Now, each release does also come with three different 95 overall cards. So it really just depends on who's playing in the actual playoffs. So last year during the wild card, we had the Colts, we had the Ravens, we also had the Bills, we also did have the Buccaneers, we had the Rams, you know, and pretty much every single team playing gets a card. So this is a promo where if your team made the playoffs, you're probably going to get a card in the game, which is absolutely awesome because if you are rocking your theme team and your theme team made the playoffs, you're like, oh crap, I'm guaranteed to get something at least okay. Now, you're not 100% going to get the best cards, but you're going to get, you know, at least a decent card. Now, of course, in order to complete these sets, you do have to use these lower overall cards and then so on and so on as you complete each set on this list. So with that being said, though, again, like I said, as we go through the 395s right here, uh, 95, 93, 91, 89, 87, these all will go ahead and and be completed in order to go ahead and get the higher overall version so overall wise the sets are pretty plain and simple now will we go ahead and get any kind of coin ups that is possible we had coin ups in the past where we did go ahead and i think it was like you chose a team to begin the playoffs and depending on how many wins that team got you either got a training boost or you all you got a coin boost now i would love to see that again I would love to see them actually return with actual coin ups, but again, we had to wait and see what EA Sports does because they're weird with how they do their things. I would definitely say that. It's like over the years, they have changed so much when it comes to their actual like system of what they release, what they don't release. I think it's because of the fact that they're like, they don't want to give us too much coins. And if we make too much coins off one promo, we'll probably go ahead and not spend money. So. With that being said, there also is going to be solo challenges. I'm not sure if they're still here. Let's see. Okay, there's not. But pretty much the solo challenges are pretty simple. They're just related around the exact premise of, you know, like whatever playoff teams are in the playoffs. You'll probably play a solo challenge sequence uh, for them. Now, most likely it's going to be this typical free 95 overall player for doing uh, the solo challenges. There probably will be house rules too. They'll probably give you another 95. So probably can see a couple of ni free 95s from this solo challenge sequence, which isn't really crazy because, of course, we're kind of getting into that 96, 97, 98 overall range anyway for this time of the year. So 95s are going to start becoming the, I guess, free gimme players. Um, and then eventually we'll get to higher overalls. But this is really just where everything kicks off. We have, you know, this promo, again, like I said, we're going to get Team of the Year, which is going to be a crap ton of 96s, 97s. We're going to get a Super Bowl promo, which will really get kicked into the 96, 97 overall cards. And I think right here we do have the Super Bowl promo right here, which, again, like I said, you know, we have the past players, the present players. This is when we really kick into the 96, 97 overall players even more. We have the MVP award, which we already I showed you a video of me uh, doing in uh, a bundle opening for it. So I already have that collectible ready to go whenever the MVP does get crowned. So crazy time of the year. You know, it is the end of Mutt 22, really. This is when, you know, Madden season ends and we kind of start talking about Madden 23. But that does not mean this is not going to be a great promo. And based on what I understand, based on what I saw with Gut Fox, there is other promos that we might be getting during this time too. So this might not all be just this exact, you know, playoff, then team of the year, then Super Bowl. 
we might also get some other things in there too so it looks like ea sports might have a couple tricks up to sleep i'm really hoping so too because uh this month is always the exciting month but if you throw in some other things that would be absolutely crazy i mean can you imagine if they threw in golden tickets at this time of year i, I don't know i don't know again like i said just speculation just looking at it right now at face value should be a very exciting we'll put out a prediction video probably sometime tomorrow predicting all these playoff cards talking about you know what the who I think is going to be getting cards. I mean, it kind of is a little bit easier because we have it limited down to the exact playoff teams. But for the playoff legends, I'm going to guess right now, Deion Sanders, Terrell Owens. We'll probably get another Joe Montana. Uh, we could also get a um, Ronnie, uh, probably a Ronnie Lott, possible. We could also get a, um, ooh, I want to say Nitran Lane, but I don't think he was in the playoffs. Uh, so tell me down below, guys, your thoughts and opinions, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.